So friends, Elvis and Priscilla divorced October the 9th, 1973 in Santa Monica, California. And during this time or shortly after this, she opened a boutique called Biss and Bow with her friend Olivia Biss. Olivia was a designer and they decided to do this thing together. They started out at this location, 409 North Robertson Boulevard in West Hollywood, and this is what it looks like today. Then they moved from this location to 9650 Santa Monica Boulevard in Beverly Hills, about two blocks from Rodeo Drive. This is Priscilla outside. This is her out front. This is her on that right side right there. You'll find a ton of photos there. Now let's go. So friends, we got some things in, in but I'm in the shade so you can see this. This is... Biss and Bo, that was her boutique, and it was right there. You can actually make out, you see that, that little brick column right there, is right there. And you can also see things on the street, on the side, even the, the stoplight right there still looks basically about the same. That was Priscilla's boutique. Now Rodeo Drive is, is it one block or two blocks? It's one block. So the next block down is Rodeo Drive. And what's interesting is you see that right there. That's old school Beverly Hills. One street over is where Lucy lived, right over there. So she lived on, on that block right there that you could see. Then you have this block, and then you have Rodeo. She could literally walk right down here. So Biss and Bo right there. That's where Priscilla's Boutique was. Right here in Beverly Hills. So this column that you see right there is that column right there. And it looks like the front door was here at the time and you can see now that's no longer the entrance but this was the entrance part. You can see where it was right there. This is inside her boutique. Actually, I told you wrong. Or is this Camden? It's actually two blocks. That's Camden there. Rodeo's the next thing. It's two blocks down. I couldn't remember if it was one or two, but it's actually two. So there you go, friends. Now you know. Biss and Bo. This is Priscilla out front right here with her dog. Look at that, right on the corner, right there where that arrow is. Then this is her inside, some more inside fashion. She did a lot of the modeling for this, so I think the way it may have been was she was the model and Miss Biss was the designer of a lot of these clothes. Looks like a boutique I would expect to see around Rodeo. Inside working, and these are modeling poses of some of the clothes. Then this is an example of some of the clothing made. You see it says Biss and Bow by Olivia, which would be Olivia Biss. That's an example of a dress. Forever yours, Biss and Bow. You could still find these things. Look at these pants. This is 70s bell bottoms, as you would expect. This is an example of a tag from that era. That's the front, this is the back. Then this is an example of customers. This is Barbara Gould married to Elliot Gould, otherwise known as Barbara Streisand. You see that says 301 North Carrollwood Drive, which was next door to Walt Disney, and up the street from Elvis's Montevale house, which is where I believe that Priscilla was living at the time that this place opened. This receipt is Aretha Franklin, and she wanted it shipped, so I don't think she actually went in there. This one is Natalie Wood which it says Natalie Wagner, if you notice, because she was married to Robert Wagner. By the way, Priscilla's original name was Wagner. Her father passed when she was about six months old, and her mother remarried, and she took the man that she remarried's name, Boyu. And last but not least on the star list, Cher. And you know that this looks just like something Cher would wear. In fact, here she is wearing some Biss and Bow. Yes, she is. In December of 1973, when they opened, they were guests on the Mike Douglas show, Olivia Biss and Priscilla. And these are screenshots from that time frame. That is Olivia right there with Mike Douglas. That is Priscilla with Mike Douglas. That is Olivia. That is Priscilla. And here's a little fashion show. There's Priscilla in some Biss and Bow on the Mike Douglas show. 
Yep, that was a rhyme. So in conclusion, Biss and Bo opened in 1973. They closed in 1976, all while Elvis was still alive, as you know. I have no idea what happened. I don't want to speculate. I'm sure these two are still friends, and it could have been a number of things. You know, life goes on, friends. I just thought this was something interesting I bet many of you did not know about. Yep, Priscilla Presley had a boutique with her friend Olivia Biss. Yes, indeed she did. So if you want to support this effort, make sure that you subscribe, like, and then join. That helps us to get more videos out there. Yes, it does. 